So as it is Halloween, I have a spoopy poem for you. And it, it's inspired by a seance that we did in third year on Halloween night. Because we're crazy like that. So this one's called Pregnancy. Yeah, I know. Last week, I kind of did something stupid. It was an accident, really. It shouldn't have happened, but it did. It was night time and there were candles. What more can I say? Her cheeks were flushed and her blue eyes sparkled. If I was a poet, I might say sparkled like the stars. Her delicious perfume floated on the air like a bag of sherbet didabs. <laughs> the lights were dimmed and we held hands. You could probably guess what it led to. It was meant to be, but now I'm in a mess with an unexpected responsibility thrust upon me. Yep, that's right, you guessed it. I got my girlfriend possessed. <laughs> a randagog the night stalker is now what we have to call her. And you have absolutely no idea of the expenditure for keeping an undead executioner. She's still very pretty, my girlfriend, my BFF, but no one understands our precarious situation and I appear to be stuck with this impaler skater. They said she'd come back after a few days, but I'm starting to fear the worst. Though this Arandagog is pretty good at kebabs and the way she skewers those taters. Thank you. So this is a new poem which I haven't performed anywhere before yet. So this poem is called Don't Listen to This Poem. Oh no no no! What are you doing here? I thought I said don't listen to this poem. Pardon? You still want to listen? Are you sure? Well okay but it's not pretty. I'm so, so sorry. Will you go out with me? Will you hold my hand and walk in the park with me? Kick at leaves and taste the smoky smell of autumn on your lips? Or throw snowballs at, at me before retreating inside for hot chocolate and an open fire? Will you write with me? Will you fight with me? Will you play fight with me? Will you help me to make others realize that immigration levels are rising because of the actions our country started? <laughs> Like dropping bombs, sending whirling bits of shrapnel flying through the air to puncture lungs, eyes, hearts, children. Will you help me make others realise that a refugee is defined as someone who has been forced to leave their country in order to escape war, persecution or natural disaster? Will you help me make people to see that every life lost is a tragedy? It should have stopped at one, not 2,500 and counting. Will you help me to spread the word that Britain was the first to use concentration camps? That we subjugated vast parts of the world, forced our will and dominion over them like some childish god? What part of that is great? We, d we never deserved that title. We haven't earned it. Will you help me to understand how we've got it? Will you come with me to help provide medical supplies to other war-torn countries? Will you kiss me? Will you hold my hand tight when I lose someone? Will you emigrate with me? Leave this godforsaken country with me? Will we have children together? I quite like Teddy for a boy's name and Daisy for a girl. Will we grow old together? Will you nerd out with me? Will you read with me and play computer games with me? Will you watch Star Wars with me? It would only take 15 hours back to back. Yes, I researched it. Will you watch all seven seasons of Pretty Little Lies with me? I promise it's good. Can we throw cream pies at politicians together? Can we leave surreptitious banana skins in number 10 Downing Street in checks? It would be funny. They can't slip up any more than they have been already. Can we stop the hate? Can we show the world that humanity can live in peace for just one day? Death is a natural part of life, but not when we are the cause of it. We will both die one day, but it is not this day. Can we just leave the world behind and travel through time and space? Would you become a superhero for me? Would you try to change the world to stop anything bad from happening to me? Would you be my partner in crime? Would you play crew sticks with me? Would you have a nerf and fight with me? Will you go out with me? Thank you.